Okay, you know how I told you to get out of 3D, then you're going to be happier and happier and happier, let go of the past, don't have attachments, no fear, no worry, and now I stepped you up to no judgment, because judgment is in 4D, and hopefully you've watched all my videos up to this point, and you've followed all the directions, and you've got a handle on 3D vibrations and how to avoid them. Um, and how to, if you go down to them, laugh at them and go, ah, oh, 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 I gotcha, I practice this, back up you go, happier and happier and happier. Now to get through 4D, we've got new instructions. You're still going to stick with the happier and happier and happier, but you've got some other pitfalls. You've got the pigeons and the geckos trying to get your attention, okay? And they're going to catch you at your lowest, and they're going to come in, and they're going to say, oh, we can save the day, come get on our ship. Uh, we are the galactic whatever. We are the federation of whatever. We are the angels of whatever. We are the we are the ascended masters of whatever. We are the, we've got this, here's pictures of our planet that you, we will take you, and you will have no worries, and, and uh, we'll take care of everything, and you just follow our little rules or do what we say and everything will be hunky-dory. And for the most part, especially the service to others people, that is true. Of course, you'll have to do what they tell you to do in their way. It's very regimented in all these places, but they're beautiful and you'll be taken care of. The service to self people, basically they're going to test you and see if you're strong enough to go to the next level. So you're always going to fight very much like 3D, only huh, on steroids and then some. So you're going to have to avoid all that. Now, how do you do that? Well, the best and easy way, because I've given you the easy way to get 5D is happier and happier and happier. That's the short and sweet of it all. And if you want to avoid any kind of problems with 4D, you keep your feet squarely on this planet. I know I want to go get in the spaceships and fly around too, but you will be at huge risk if you get off of this planet. This planet is who you, who you are attached to who will get you to 5D. As long as you're happier and happier and happier, happier, stay out in nature a lot, stick with this planet, she will take you there. You are her child. She will protect you as long as you kind of do a little bit of your part, try. And she will give you all the assistance. You've got all kinds of assistance all over the place to help you make that transition. But you have to make it. You have to make the decision. Because all of these bright, shiny people, and if you're out there looking at the planet, as I've told you before, as less and less of planet Earth is in uh, 4D going to 5D, other people will be collecting data and showing it to you. The Christians will see the rapture end of days. The uh, survivalists will see governments taking over. Uh, the nuclear holocaust people will show you uh, people who have nuclear bomb after nuclear bomb, and they will all have their scenario. They get to. They're creator gods, and they get to have the scenario that they desire. So as uh, Earth goes out of 4D altogether, then all of those people in groups will see the Earth uh, imploding or exploding the way that they believe will happen. And she leaves this. So if they believe that she's going to be blown up by a nuclear all costs, then that's what she'll see. If you are listening to them and watching them, you will see it too. Okay? And when that gets close, if you're paying attention to any of those other groups, the sea, doom, and gloom, then when the geckos and the pigeons come and go, here, I will save the day, come with us before the world blows up and you blow up with it, then those people are going to jump on board the geckos and the pigeons. Unless they are even more scared of the geckos and the kid pigeons. And then uh, the pigeons are really good at this whole Christian thing where they're going to show Jesus come and lift them up with energy. So the geckos are more into spaceships and that kind of thing, all tech stuff. And the pigeons are more into like magical, energetic movements like here I am Jesus and you will all float up to me and I will take you off to heaven. Their heaven is their planet. They believe it's heaven. And these guys all believe in their stories, every single one of them. Uh, they have the right to do so. They're creator gods. They have every right to do that. Your job is to choose which one you want or to create your own. I am going to 5D. That is my reality and that's my right as a creator god. I am offering that option to you for you to go your way to that place. Or you can follow any of the other stories or make up your own. It's all good.
But at least I'm here telling you the truth that what all of that stuff is happening. Of course, you can't know the truth and really be into the Christian rapture, end of the world, Satan, blow up thing. You've got to be in somewhat amnesia. You can't listen to me. Otherwise, playing that game would not be effective. Wouldn't work. You'd be you're going, well, I know I'm a creator God, but I'm going to play like it's the end of the world. Yeah. So understand that the reason why they're so vehement is because that's the game they want to play. That's the experience they want to have. Don't interfere with them. They will squash you like a bug. They will get bunches of them and squash you. Just nod your head and go, great game, love it, wish you well, I'm doing this. Okay? That's how we get through 4D. You got to lose the attachment. You got to lose the ego. You got to lose the jealousy. You got to lose the judgment. You have to absolutely left fear far behind and be happier and happier and happier. And don't pay any attention to any of these other people in the games that they're playing. Focus on what you want to do. If you don't like my 5D Earth, create another scenario. You are a creator God. If you want to jump right through 5D and just shoot right through that and go home, then visualize that. You can have anything you want. Anything you want. I'm telling you what I'm doing. Because I really would like to be in this body and physicality on a good planet. Okay, battery's up. Gotta go. Love you bunches. Huge hugs. See you later. Bye.